Pat, all right. Uh, you know, you came into last season uh, lean and mean. How did uh, how did you handle this summer? The same way, obviously. I prepared myself again like I did last summer, so I came in really good shape again. So, you know, hopefully everything keeps falling into place for me this season, not only for me, but just the team as a whole. Uh, a lot is uh, riding on this season, understandably. So when you look back at what you guys were able to accomplish and you try to do that again this year, how tough is it going to be? Because you're not going to be surprising any teams this season. Yeah, it's going to be really tough this year. Uh, we can't. Uh, we got to co compete like we did all year last year. We got to do the things we did all year. Listen to Todd, you know what he has to say, and get us to where we need to be. I think what we did last year is over. This year, this is a new year, and hopefully the guys are excited to get started. And that feeling that we lost last year, bring it into another season and know what happened. You had a tremendous season yourself. How do you try to replicate that? What do you got to do? We see physically, but what do you got to do mentally to try to do that again or better? Yeah, obviously uh, I did have a good year. So for me, it's being consistent and doing it again and again. So I can't just re do last year. Last year's over. You know, I, I want to go out there and do it again. And hopefully I can continue that. For me, which is playing big, going in the net hard and protecting pucks, moving my feet and doing the little things right. So hopefully I can find a way to do it again. I would love to do it again. So I think for me, I think just the team as a whole, hopefully we can achieve some goals again this year. Uh, you guys always talk about how much uh, <clears throat> everyone on the team really likes each other, wants to play for each other. What's it like seeing these guys again after you know a few months away from each other? Yeah, it is. It's exciting. Uh, you know, the, the laughs, the jokes, uh, messing with each other in the locker rooms back to full effect. So it's good to see the guys go out to lunch with them and just catch up. You know, everyone's had a busy summer, so it's hard to catch up with everyone. You know, you text here and there, but it's good to catch up when you sit down and have some lunch and just see how the summer was. So it's good to be back to see the faces and see some new faces too. What kept you busy during the summer outside of focusing on hockey? Well, yeah, obviously for me it was working out and skating, but me and my son keep me busy. Uh, we went to Disney World. We did a lot of fun stuff, hockey tournaments. So me and him and uh, my girlfriend had a really busy summer this year. How's his hockey skills? I saw he was doing some uh, roller hockey stuff. You were taking him out to the rink at night. And uh, who was the bigger kid at Disneyland? I think I was. <laughs> I don't think he'll realize or appreciate the things that he saw in Disney World. I mean, that was, I mean, it's like, I can't believe it. It's just your words, words can't explain Disney World, how real everything yeah. looks. And But it was truly amazing. It was fun. And we had some good laughs. Those are the moments that we cherish the most and will memories will last forever. You were Snapchatting like a frozen performance, like the whole thing, hey? Yeah, like yeah. <laughs> you could get in trouble for that. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, yeah, it was fun, though. It was, the light shows, the fireworks, I mean, everything about Disney World just puts on an amazing show. So, you know, he's more of the ride guy and seeing all that fun stuff and the characters. He likes the princesses, which every man should, but... <laughs> So, but it was good times. It was really fun. And, you know, he had a blast. My girlfriend had a fun time. So all three of us just had a really good time.